Hello, everyone. It's a pleasure to be here with you in this session. Yeah. And it's a pleasure to talk about the experience of Izmir. My hometown, Izmir, is a city of 4.5 million inhabitants by the Aegean Sea. It is one of the largest port cities in the Mediterranean. And logistics, trade, agriculture, tourism, and industry are significant sectors in the city. The impact of the outbreak are fierce. And the shrinking economy makes this situation extremely alarming. The deterioration in the economy and decrease in taxes leads a decline in municipal budget. So in order to face these challenges, we needed to develop innovative responses. And when, I, when I'm going to talk about these responses, the, the first one is um, supporting the agriculture supporting the agriculture to producers' cooperatives. We try to support them in every production and marketing steps. The second one is supporting entrepreneurship and innovation. We recently established a company called ISQ, which brings together all the leading economic stakeholders within the company's decision-taking boards, ISMIR Chamber of Commerce, Export Associations, Chamber of Industry, Commodity Exchange, Young Businessmen Association, all the leading uh, economics uh, actors there on the boards. In this way, we bring together city leaders to boost innovation and enhance the entrepreneurship ecosystem in Izmir. The third response that we, um, we, we took uh, in, in, in this pandemic we support uh, economic sectors of Izmir uh, with Izmir Fair Company. This is a municipal corporation aiming to increase economic activities in the city. Um, and the city's economic activities with other cities all around the world. Again, in here, this, in this company, the leading business organizations are represented in the boards of the company their demands and needs guide the activities of the company. As all the fairs around the world have been canceled because of the pandemic, we decided to use digitization to continue the operations of the Izmir Fair Company. We will hold many of our exhibitions online. And in this way, we are going to support the economic sector of the city. Um, Izmir Metropolitan Municipality is I mean, relatively resourced municipality with 1.5 billion uh, euro budgets with its subsidiaries and um, municipal companies. That's why I'm positive that Izmir Metropolitan Municipality can solve many challenges in terms of employment and economic activities. We have the power and the resources to revitalize the local economy. So we can achieve that um, uh, purpose, this objectives by shortening the supply chains and using innovation and digitization. Thanks to institutional innovation, we managed to establish several ways to bring uh, producers and consumers together in agriculture sectors, as agriculture is an important um, uh, sector uh, where many people are employed uh, within the city. I want to uh, give more details about this uh, issue on how we support the agricultural productions and uh, how we uh, cooperate with the cooperatives. First of all, um, municipality here signed a purchasing agreement with the local agricultural cooperatives. Um, and now, after buying, we distribute this foods to people who are in need, and we also sell some of them through the newly found markets. Um, within the scope of milk distribution campaigns of the municipality, we distributed 1,300,000 liters of milk to 125,000 of kids. Uh, municipality also implements a project of mobile market. We take the foods to the door of the citizens. 
these projects, the mobile market projects, started during the uh, pandemic period in order to help people to stay at home. And it worked so well so far. And finally, I want to mention that due to measures taken against COVID-19, there is a sh shortage of agricultural workers for harvesting. To overcome this difficulty, the municipality launched a campaign to support agricultural production. The city used its digital platform called We the Izmir. In this way, we reach out to volunteers between the ages of 20 and 25. And the eligible volunteers, they sign up for harvesting. And the municipality provides them masks, gloves, sanitizers, as well as free transportation and lunch. And volunteers are provided some incentives and prizes in order to, I mean, uh, make them available. Uh, these uh, prizes um, are things like food packages, free pass, and uh, some other kinds of incentives. Uh, with these kinds of innovative solutions, uh, we're trying to incentivize and support the producers and help our citizens. We try to shorten the supply chain and use the technology in order to improve the efficiency within the economic sectors of Izmir. Um, this is how we fight with the economic difficulties and economic decline uh, within our cities. Thank you, Emil.